Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Every time I get in front of this camera and I talk about ammo, there are several people who get back with me, both online and in my own personal life that say, I am out of the game. I'm not shooting my guns, I'm not going to the range, I'm not buying these stupid crazy prices because the scarcity and the elevated cost is too much for me to bear at this time. And I get it, it was a horrible two years. And during those two years, we saw a whole bunch of new gun owners and many reasons why there was a shortage. And we also read articles where these idiots say, it's going to be three to five years, man. You know, if you even plan on getting a gun, don't expect to shoot it. And they're throwing that nonsense out there, leading us to believe this is worse than what we thought. What am I going to do? Well, I want to encourage you right now to shop around a bit and see what's available, see what's affordable, and it's time to get back into the game. Why am I saying that? Well, I will tell you this. I'm not bragging, but I never left the game. I never stopped shooting. I always went to the range just as much as I normally did prior to this nonsense because I stocked up and I continue to do so. Now, the common calibers of handgun and rifle, I, I think are available. I was just at Cabela's, I saw uh, 223-556, I, I saw uh, 762X39 and 308s. I saw 940 and 45. Actually, I picked up this 500 round pack of Winchester white box. I never even, I've never seen anything like this before. I mean, I've seen Win Winchester white box, but not packaged like this. 500 rounds. Now, if you think about it, in the midst of the scarcity, this was going for a dollar round, 500 bucks. And prior to all this nonsense, maybe 125, 130 would be average. I picked this up for 189. All right. So I, I thought that was, given the time that we are in, a fair deal, given the time. And I also picked up 100 rounds here of federal 9mm. 9mm is by far the most popular choice of firearm and the most popular type of ammo that people are, are searching for. Yes, 45 is a big one, but the 357 SIG, the 57 by 28 millimeter, the 380 ACP, those are still very scarce. So good luck with that. You're, you're going to overpay above and beyond. But these these weren't that bad. I also picked up this uh, Winchester self-defense loads. I only got a box. It was like 25 bucks, so a little over a buck a round. But these are plus P loads. You say, well, you must really need the ammo. Well, a while back, I picked up this 1,000 rounds of Bellin. What is Bellin? I have no idea what Bellin is. All these oddball companies are showing up. They seem to be producing some real good ammo. We are scared by the, the administration's ban on Russian ammo, yet I'm seeing some of that stuff. Not a lot, but I'm seeing some of it. Contracts were made prior to these idiots going forth with this ban, and I'm not even sure where that stands entirely because I hear that it's not going to be available, but yet I see that it's available. So what is it? You know, we have all these, these myths, these speculations going on out there, but yet, if you just get to your local store, you may see something that you haven't seen in a while, and it may just inspire you to get out there and begin shooting. The 40s and 45s, they're out there, still very expensive. Uh, not quite to the percentage decreased that I paid for that 9mm, but it is out there. So make it a time to, I wouldn't say plenish and replenish and do everything that I did, but... Pick up a box or two, you know, pick up a box or three and, and let it build up and then get back to the range. Let's start Let's start having fun again. Let, let's stop this, you know, it's going to be three to five years. I'm not seeing it. I'm seeing ammo that is on the shelves, a lot of ammo on the shelves, and I'm seeing that it's finally beginning to drop in price. So let's get back into the game. Let's start having fun. Let's start buying ammo. Let's start shooting our guns and let's not let this scarcity and shortage get the best of us because we are indeed gun people. We love our guns. We love our ammo and it is time to get back in the game. 
If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.